Hey everyone, I'm JavaScript Joe, and today we're going to be building a Gatsby site in less than five minutes. I'm afraid I haven't been a very good host on Sport. You see, I'm Gatsby. Aha, not that one. This one, old sport, it'll look something like this. But let's get started. First thing you want to do is check that you have Node installed. You can do that by running node dash dash version, check for npm, same thing, npm dash dash version, and then you're going to want to install the Gatsby CLI. You can do that by running npm install dash dash global Gatsby dash CLI. After you do that, double check that it installs correctly by running Gatsby dash dash version. Now that we have the Gatsby CLI installed, we can create a new Gatsby site using a starter. So the command runs like this. We have Gatsby and then new, a new site, and then the name of the project. So I'm just calling this my default project and then the GitHub URL for that. So this is in the description if you want to just copy and paste it. When we hit enter, Gatsby will run. Once that's done, CD into that directory, then run code dot to open the directory if you have Visual Studio Code installed or use any other text editor. Cool, so here's our site. First thing we're gonna do is run Gatsby develop. Cool, so now if we head over to your browser and go to localhost 8000, there's our site, awesome. So let's go ahead and change that where it says hi people. So if you go on the left in the, the file structure, you'll see source, Pages, go to index.js. Here, I'm just gonna make a change. Old sport. Let's add a paragraph tag. I love to code. Hit save. Boom, there we go. Hi, old sport. I love to code. Next step, let's add this to GitHub. I'm just gonna do Gatsby site. Cool. Hit create. We're just going to go with push an existing repository because that's what we have. So I'm going to copy all of this. First thing we need to do is run git init. Cool. Git add. Git commit. First commit old sport. Cool. Then we can paste. Boom. We're on GitHub. Head back over to GitHub and you'll see all of our files there. So now let's deploy it to Netlify. So head over to app.netlify.com. You can log in. I'm going to log in with GitHub. I already have an account. We're going to do new site from Git. We're going to connect to GitHub. Then we're going to select the one that we just did. So I called mine Gatsby site. Cool. There it is. Click on it. Master branch, build command, Gatsby build, publish directory, public, deploy site. Here you'll see that it's deploying your site. Shortly after, you should see your site is deployed. If we click on this link, and there you go. Hi, old sport. I love to code. You built and deployed a Gatsby site in less than five minutes. If you want to learn more about Gatsby, I suggest you head over to gatsbyjs.org slash docs you can read their docs and i would go to the v2 docs which is actually next.gatsbyjs.org that's what we did in this tutorial if you go to docs they're super helpful they've got a ton of information and there's a tutorial if you want something more in depth especially if you're new to react this is a great place to start as always if you have a question hit me up on twitter i'm at jsjoio thanks for watching